Like, what just happened? What did I just see? So, Team Kenya in the FIBA 3x3 under 23 in Lublin, Poland. Their first game was just horrendous, man. Like, it, it, it was just horrendous. I, I just, I'm just coming off just, you know, re-watching this game. I know I, I'm going to come out with, like, the full analysis of, like, play-by-play, play, just look at every single thing that we did, just as I've been doing in the previous 3x3s, but but man, this was dude, this was this was a this this was a dud game, like very dud game. Like okay, we had our, 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 our we had our team in there. We've got Medina, Mary Lisa, Marianne, got Diana in there. I mean, there was no production coming from Marianne's side. I mean, I didn't just I just don't know what happened. Like the, the whole team just shut down, like shut down completely. Shots weren't falling. I mean. And it was just, it was just, uh, just a shooting barrage, especially coming from the Netherlands side. And they just served us two pointers. They hit like, we had a player like hitting like three two pointers. We had two pointers just spreading out, and the game just ended early. And I mean, it, it was just, it was just something that when I just saw it on the onset. I just knew like it was game over. This was those games. This was one of those games like you know just dictate the tempo of what is supposed to happen moving forward in the whole contest. Not riding off or anything. But if this continues, it just you'll just be knocked off like that, and you'll even go deeper into the quarterfinals, semis or finals. But man, this was this was embarrassing. Twenty two Netherlands, five Kenya. I mean only only five points on one pointers so this this was this was not good especially we're not even get we didn't even get any production from two pointers no two point shooters only one free throw no going in no even having the ability to draw fouls we're just beaten by you know fundamental basketball and it just shows like there's just a huge gap in there and not carrying shooters i know we we didn't have the services of Ashley, Ashley, she played in the 3x3 in Red Bull in Serbia, so I'm pretty sure she wasn't able to like get in there. But we just needed, we just needed somebody to shoot the ball, especially from two pointers, because that's what we, that's that's the weapon that the Netherlands team just used. I I've just watched this and I'm, man, it's it's just sure up disappointing. And then I watched the China versus Kenya game, China 21. Kenya 11, okay, you can say like there's an improvement on scoring wise, but you can see we're just being beat by double digits. The first game against the Netherlands team, we just got beat by double digits. This one again, and at least we had one two pointer that went in, and one on one on on you know the one point field goals. Medina she led with five points in there. Mary Lisa only one, and you expect like Mary Lisa's production to be like shooting the three ball. And I don't know what to expect from, you know, game to game. I don't know what to expect from Marianne because she's just flaky. In the first game against the Netherlands team, she had, she went scoreless. I mean, this was something that is we're not accustomed to seeing her, sh you know, play like that. But I mean, that 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 first game was a dud game. But hopefully, you can be able to like pick 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 it up uh, as we move progressive. We just progressively move forward because man, this is. It was just beyond disappointing because I just stopped everything just to make sure to watch these games. And when I just watched them, it, we just looked like frazzled, and we didn't just we didn't even look like we were confident in like you know making those shots, especially from outside in the first game. But in the second game, you could see at least at least there was that you know that that zeal and that fight a bit to be able to do that but the three point scoring barrage especially coming from China I mean they just ended uh, they just ended us in, in two pointers they didn't even like make a lot of layups like that they hit a total of eight two pointers to Kenya's I mean <laughs> to Kenya's one two pointer so of course they're going to win this game and this game this game end so early because they're able to hit like the 21 point mark very fast as, as even you can see in the netherlands game we had like three minutes in regulation kenya versus china we had like you know what like about three three and a half minutes left and they're able to win it just speaks to the the 
skill that we've had and it speaks to like our preparation i don't think we were mentally prepared in there i'm not doubting the skill set of the players because the women's side time and time again have just been you know improving slowly but given like the magnitude of the stage you've seen the we've seen us play in the hammermet games it was very good made the finals didn't win it we played again in the Algeria 3x3, which was especially a good performance, especially coming from the women who won it all. But, you know, getting outside the continent, we just look frazzled a lot. And a lot of teams are just gearing up to make sure to win those games easily and try to, you know, find consistent ways to win basketball games. But looking at the way we are approaching the games, especially when teams are outside our continent, it's not the greatest and i'm not sure how you're going to fix this because moving forward again we're just going to have like a lot of you know teams just coming and throw and, and, and throwing the best their best punches at us like we, we didn't even lay a glove on this team so man I, i'll just release a couple of videos uh today just talking about just having like those game reviews like the way i used to and just more detailed just looking at like play by play just looking at you know the what we saw on defense how our offense looks like our offense looked great especially in the in the 3x3 games in algeria but our offense this time given like the teams that we've we've we're matching up against we saw the netherlands team they just did not hesitate especially shooting the three ball china team they knew they do not want to hesitate you know shooting that three ball because they saw our defense and they saw like you know we, we were very very like flat-footed especially when it comes to like defending the three ball and they just capitalized in there and just had that quick follow through and just stoke scored it so man i just come up with videos just talking about this so stay tuned so um yeah i'm, I'm just <laughs> i'm just leaving it at that right now so this is just a quick one i just said uh, let me just you know drop this first before i drop the whole load in the others no pause <laughs> i dropped the whole other videos on my channel so yeah if, you, if you're seeing this on instagram please you know follow me on there just click the follow and also hit that bell if you're watching this on youtube please be sure to subscribe to the channel hit the bell so that you can get notified and um i'm out guys peace